Hey folks, happy Friday. We continue our pastor's devotional series um, and uh, using our um, FUMC CV prayer calendar from February. It's Friday, February 5. And we're in the Gospel of Matthew, um, uh, chapter 26, verse 28. Matthew 26, 28. All right, we're right in the middle of the passage, the institution of the Lord's Supper in the way that the Gospel of Matthew um, uh, de, uh, depicts that. Um, and so 26, 28 is when Jesus is holding the cup um, of wine and he says, For this is my blood of the covenant, which is poured out for many for the forgiveness of sins. This is my blood of the covenant, which is poured out for many for the forgiveness of sins. And so... As a sort of study of scripture, what we, of, uh, of course, might think of is the uh, Passover in Egypt. Uh, and you remember that uh, there was going to be a sort of wrath that was visited upon um, the uh, Pharaoh and, and all the Egyptians who had been oppressing the Israelites. And so the Israelites were to, to uh, get the blood of a lamb and put it on their doorpost, and that was a sign of who they they were, and so this blood of the lamb sort of saved them from that uh, particular wrath of God upon those people who were oppressing them. Multiple other times in which um, blood of a lamb was was spilled, and so here Jesus becomes that um, sacrificial lamb, that Paschal lamb, um, and uh, we we see that acted out in the communion. And so every time we take partake of Holy Communion. We are uh, honoring and remembering and recognizing Jesus' sacrifice um, and that Jesus' blood um, spilled out is what saves us, that sort of Passover event. Um, and so our lives are marked by that blood and therefore we are saved. In a devotional way, I would encourage you. Um, you know, we're getting really close to the season of Lent and Lent is a time of introspection and um, looking at our lives and, and cleaning out our lives. Um, and so this passage about the poured out for many for the forgiveness of sins, uh, that that is what this communion um, is about. And notice that Jesus doesn't say for you, and he's not talking to, to the people just at the table, um, but this blood has been poured out for many for the forgiveness of sins. It is, that is our place of assurance that we have been justified we have been made right by jesus uh, been made righteous again and we have a new opportunity i know folks are always beating up on themselves hard to forgive yourself sometimes this is a reminder uh, that we are forgiven by god let us forgive ourselves wake up tomorrow it's a new day get started again in this journey of faith so hope this is helpful to you happy friday have a great weekend god bless